In this video, we're going to do some quick worked examples of matching equations with their graphs. We've got six different graphs and six equations. We need to match these equations with the graphs. Let's start off with the easiest ones. The easiest ones are straight lines. We've got a straight line graph here and a straight line graph here, or if you like, linear graphs. Linear graphs can be written in the form y is equal to mx plus c. So if we look down our list, we've got y is equal to 3x plus 1 and y is equal to minus x plus 4. This graph is going to have a positive gradient and that gradient will be 3. This one is going to have a negative gradient and the gradient will be minus 1. So if we look at this one, this one has a positive gradient. We can also see that it cuts the y-axis at the point 0, 1. So we can put on that this one is y is equal to 3x plus 1. Therefore, this one right here is going to be y is equal to minus x plus 4. We can see it cuts the y-axis at 4 and it has a gradient of minus 1. Let's now move on to the quadratic graphs. We can see there are two quadratic graphs as we have parabolas. If we look at this one, this graph opens upwards and this one opens downwards. This is a positive quadratic, so we'll have a positive x squared term. This one is a negative quadratic, so we'll have a negative x squared term. If we look at the list, we've got two quadratic equations. y is equal to 2x squared minus 3x plus 1, and y is equal to minus x squared plus 4x. This one is going to be the positive quadratic, and this one right here is going to be the negative quadratic. So all we've done is gone ahead and matched those up. That now leaves us with two graphs. We have the graph here and the graph here. This one is a cubic graph. So if we look now at our list, we've got x cubed minus 3x plus 1. We can match that up. This one here is an exponential graph. And all we're left with is 2 to the x. So we can simply say now that 2 to the x is the graph just here. So we've taken six equations and matched them to each of their graphs.